Hello! My first set of fansign albums came in from My Music Taste, so I'm really excited right now. I don't think I'm in the exact best state to film, I just don't feel super awesome, but I am really excited and I can't just let my signed album sit in the box for too long because I'm just gonna get stressed about it. So I'm going to open it up, I have to block out my name, and I'm not going to do all of like the photo card pulls. I was planning on doing maybe a set of 20 albums for my channel. But I'm not entirely sure what I should do in terms of like making a video of it, but I will be selling all of the albums at a very low price and then selling the photo cards separately slash in bundles with albums. If you're interested in buying albums at a cheap price slash photo cards at a kind of cheap price, definitely check my socials and I'll also link to my eBay in the description. I'm going to open the box that I think has my signed album, and we'll go from there. I'll also be showing the fan signed photo cards in particular. I'm pretty sure it's this box because all of the other ones have the album set up in sets of five, but this one has one that's odd. So, see, they're in sets of five, and then this one's in four, and I think that's the signed album. So I'm gonna try to gently take these out of the box. It smells like all the money I spent. It's a bittersweet smell. Oh, this, it's it. It is sealed, so I think this is the signed album. I don't want to open it. All right, so this is the signed album. I'm sorry that I blocked it out in a not very pretty way. I haven't really introduced myself on this channel and I kind of wanted to separate myself from it a little bit. Like this is just who I am as a person unboxing Luna things. But I do go by May on other social media. If you follow me on Instagram or Twitter, that's what I have my display name as. Underneath here was my full name because I wanted Luna to sign it out to my full name. It just feels a lot more personal that way and that's just what I wanted. They signed it to my full name and then it ends with a heart here. And of course, According to my friend who compared this writing on her album to some other fan sign albums and fan sign pages, I believe Heejin wrote the names for this set of albums. So we have this uh, version B album and I'll go ahead and take this off and then recover up my name and stuff because I need to get to the photo cards. <laughs> Here is a stack of photo cards with Yojin looking great and I'm just covering up my name on the album because I don't want you guys to see it. And... Wow. <laughs> uh, it doesn't feel real to be holding this album, knowing that it's been held by all of them and signed by all of them. That's just really cool. Um, I feel like I'm too tired to have real emotions right now, but I feel pretty emotional about this. And this is one of two, so I don't know what the other album will be. I don't know what version it'll be, but I do know that I saw some C version albums and now there are B versions and I don't know what the other ones are. This is really cool. <laughs> I'll try to uh, bring it up closer to the camera. So it says to May, continuation of my name, uh, with a little heart next to it and There are the signatures. I really hope that one day I can go in person and like have individual pages signed. I do have three fan sign pages from Hyunjin, but those were all through proxies. Yeah, I don't know. I hope that one day I can actually meet them in person and try to kind of communicate with them. Let's go through the fan sign photo cards. So here, oh, they feel so good. Hyojin, and these have the gradient on the back of them. Hyojin. And we have Eve, Vivi looking wonderful. Wow. Jinsel. Chu. Olivia, hey. Cherry. 
I'm really not gonna get over Go On's hair ever. It's just so distinct. Kim Lip. Heejin. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Nice little uh, landscape shot. And Hyunjin. And there they are. I don't know which one I like better, honestly. The first Orbit Ring, I guess this is technically Orbit Ring 2 for my music taste. And then I'm waiting on the third one, which got sent to a Korean address. And then I'll have to get it forwarded to me in the United States. I'll have another signed album to look at and share with you all. And then another set of photo cards. So, did I come with photo cards? I have no idea what the benefits are at this point. There's so so many of them. It makes my head hurt and it makes my wallet hurt as well. I don't actually have every single Hyunjin item, especially because some of them only went to fansign winners, so I obviously can't really get those. And I'm not going to pay hundreds of dollars for them. Thanks for joining me as I unboxed my first Luna fansign album. Hopefully it's not the last, depending on my financial situation in the future. If you're interested in buying albums slash photo cards slash special photo cards, I, I hope to put a decent price on them. Then please watch out for more information because I'll definitely talk about it later. That's all I have for now. I'll see you in the next video.